Quarter family is Amy Cannon here, trying to help you get logged into Clever. Clever is our automatic login platform, which is going to allow your child to access any of the digital content resources that your teachers are trying to push out to you. So if you've heard of things like Dreambox or Imagine Learning or Seesaw, then Clever is the way to get logged into those things. So I'm going to show you today how to get logged into Clever from your iPad or your tablet. So if you have an iPad or a tablet at home, then this is the video for you. On your iPad or tablet, the first thing you're going to need to do is download Google Chrome. Once you download Google Chrome, you're going to type this web address in. It's bit.ly forward slash SDSD Clever. Once you type this in, it's going to take you to a website that looks like this. <laughs> this should look familiar to your child. They're going to click the um, colored boxes here, and they're going to log in with their username and password. It gets a little bit tricky on a tablet, so I'm going to show you your next step. Once your child logs in, I'll show you what that's going to look like. You're going to see a bunch of different options that look like this. Anything that your child wants to do, you're going to have to download the app for it first in Clever. So let me show you what that looks like. Here are all the different applications that I've downloaded for this particular iPad. I have Dreambox, Imagine Learning, Mayan, and Seesaw. Once you download the application that your child wants to use, you have to go back into Clever in order to get logged in. So if I just click automatically on one of these things like Imagine Learning, it's not going to log me in and the kids aren't going to be able to get on. What I have to do, so it just comes up like this, what I have to do is go to back to Google Chrome. I have to click whatever I want to log into from Google Chrome. So from the Clever account, I have to click Seesaw. And then it will open that application and automatically log your child in to that app so that they can see what their teacher is sending them. This is what Seesaw would look like. I can see right now that this student has 11 activities to complete and they have a bunch of inbox messages from their teacher. One of the other applications that you can get on, so I would have to go back to Chrome to switch, would be Dreambox. So I can click on Dreambox or Imagine Learning. It's going to take me to a page that looks like this in my web browser. Loading, hold on. So it'll look something like this. Once you click Dreambox, if you click that app right there, it should open you up right into the Dreambox application and then automatically log your child in so they are ready um, to get started on Dreambox. So that is how you log into Clever on an iPad or a tablet at home. Remember this important web address, bit.ly forward slash SESD Clever, and it should be able to get you to anything you need. If you have any questions or you need help, you can email me at acondon at or contact your teacher.